Every man is not the same. Some guys are tall. Some guys are short. Some guys are skinny. Some guys are fat. Looks are different. But looks are in everything. Personalities are different. We got our guys who are a little bit more reserved, comical, charismatic, guys who set boundaries, guys who don't set boundaries. And all of these things are combined with somebody's height, weight, personality, and then you roll it all up into a ball and throw it out there in the dating market and women get a chance to, to pick. And unfortunately for black men, especially for black men who like black women, this tends to be somewhat of um, a hard pill to swallow. This is a hard path. And, and why am I talking about this? Because typically on average, black women like men who are very charismatic, very funny, even if they're not very funny, even if they're shy, even if they are boring, most black women don't like a boring man. Now, I know we could talk about most women in general. Sure, every woman wants a guy that's fun to be around. But black women, it's a little bit more difficult. You need to be able to hold a conversation. You need to be able to keep her uh, attention, which can be very difficult. And if you're the kind of man that has a hard time doing that, Despite the fact that you're intelligent, you have a good work ethic. You're a man that, um, you know, you have a, a vision for our family. You're a man that respects women. Being boring can be a hassle. Now, shout out to the lovely Miss Tech Not Fancy. She is a, a subscriber here. Check her out on Instagram. She sent me this particular clip. And this clip... It's, it's interesting, to say the least. Let's play that clip, and then we'll come back. If you're boring and nice as a man, don't date. Okay? If you are a boring, nice man, do not date. And don't let a woman find out that you're willing to spend money. Okay, don't date. You're boring, you're nice, and, and you're not shy with the credit card. You're gonna get used, whether it be intentionally or unintentionally, but you're gonna get used, okay? She's either gonna come to the conclusion and say, all right, he's too nice, but he's boring. I'm not feeling it, maybe we should go our separate ways. Or she's gonna turn around and say, well, damn. He gonna tell me yes anyway. I might as well keep on, <laughs> keep it coming. It's gonna go one of two ways, all right? You'll have the genuine woman that really cares about your well-being, or you'll have the woman that she's gonna use you because you're freaking nice and boring. She's going to end up being with a man who's not boring. He might not be nice, but she's going to be like off on the side, probably doing her own thing. With that being said, okay, it is absolutely not a guarantee that she's going to have a better experience with the guy who might not be boring, but also not nice. It's just to say, don't be surprised if your girl, you find out she's been, you know, doing a little extracurricular activities with another man and you'd be like, wait, what? I never saw that coming. Like, that's that shouldn't that's not for you you're too good for him well yeah i know i know i'm too good for him but he's not boring so as i said it's either going to be intentional or unintentional but it's it's likely going to happen so if you are boring and nice please find a hobby but don't date you see guys this, this, this clip is interesting because it's coming from a woman herself who's saying that if you're a boring man, don't even worry about dating. But what is she really saying, guys? Let's break this down. She's saying if you are a boring black man, don't date black women because... They're going to either not talk to you or they are going to listen to what I'm saying. Use you. Now, let me kind of talk about another brother here. Austin Holloman. Austin Holloman is currently in Brazil, right? And he's the guy that's kind of the antithesis of all these games and stuff being played. And, and one of the things that he talks about is in Brazil, Women don't 
play games. I'd like to play a clip of that right now, and I'll come back. So let me tell something to everybody that thinks they got an I got you moment. Like, oh, I thought Brazilian women were perfect. I never said they were perfect, but I did say they were a better deal, and I still stick to that. Now, let's talk about games in Brazil. Do women in Brazil play games? Yes, at a very, it's, it's uncommon for women here to play. As opposed to the States, it seems like everybody's going to play with you in some sort of way that is like a fucking turnoff. Now, about the drink scammer things, does that happen in Brazil? Yes, it happens everywhere in the world. But in my experiences, outside of the United States, it is at a very low rate. Because outside of the United States, especially in Brazil, women will reject you and they will ignore you and they won't, they won't talk to you if they're not interested. Is that the same case in the States? No, a woman will go on with you for weeks and months and pretend like she's interested just to extract resources out of you. There is a difference. So guys, that, that leads me to my next point. If you are the kind of black man that women find to be boring, then you know what? It's, it's no problem. It's no problem. All, all that you got to do is go to another community. And I mean, and I'm not the person that is really the kind of guy that is about, you know, not being with black women or all of that. But I I, I know that every guy's not going to be charismatic or full of energy or, or, or full of zeal or a guy who can turn it off and be nice and be mean and be nice and be mean and be nice and like have boundaries and all that stuff. And again, when you deal with the fact that you know, you're not dealing with these games like you're dealing with in America because they don't understand what a real man can do. And she even mentioned it. It doesn't even mean that her next experience is the best experience. But that's why you see so many black men dealing with non-black women. And when I'm talking about non-black women, what do I mean? non-african american women non-african american women they're not playing these games they can appreciate a man for being boring because to that woman he might actually not even be boring now i'm not saying that black women in america can't look at you like that but what i'm saying is it's been so many times that you've been through that and it makes it hard to date because you're not the most exciting guy in the room. That's what we're dealing with. And of course, you can't help that. But guess what? These are the same kinds of guys. Listen to what I'm saying. As soon as something uh, goes, on, goes wrong in their life, as they get older, who do they want to deal with? Who do they want to deal with I'll, I'll i'll tell you who they want to deal with that same boring guy they want to deal with that same boring guy now they want to deal with that guy and all of a sudden want to marry you and and all this crap no 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 keep that same energy ain't that what you wanted but guys, what do you think? It's your boy, O'Shea Duke Jackson, back at it again. With another episode of The Celebrity Junk. Appreciate you for all that you do. Subscribe to the bell. I'm out.